The Celebration of Corruption by Aiko Mandko. In their separate reactions to the questionable discharge of Senator Bkolas Iraqi by the Code of a Conduct Tribunal, the Ekiti state government, Mr. Rayo Feos, his lawyer, Mike Haakum and former aviation minister, Fanny Kao decided to celebrate corruption and impunity. One thing that is common to the three of them is that they have been indicted in the criminal diversion of public funds by XNSA, Colonel Sambo Dasuki. As Governor Faos currently enjoys immunity, his protege, Benga Agbel is on trial for keeping part of the N2.5 billion traced to the lousy governor. To avoid his imminent prosecution the governor is getting ready to ask for an extension of his second term in the EK State House. If has been confirmed that he paid N75 million from the N2.5 billion to his counsel, Akum for the defense of Agbel. On his own part, Fanny Kaode is standing with another for N3.4 billion from the N23 billion set aside for the 2015 general election by Mrs. Since these guys are keeping stolen public funds they cannot see that the Code of Conduct Tribunal did not absolve Sairaki of criminality. By upholding Syracus no case submission the tribunal said that there was no enough evidence for the accused to enter the witness box to offer any defense. Is Chief Akum interpreting that to mean that Syraki declared his assets? Or that he was not receiving full salary of a sitting governor while he is being paid the full salary of a senator? Seraki had tried to get the Code of Conduct Tribunal chairman disqualified because of his indictment by the FCC that he had once been indicted for collecting bribe from an accused person. Since the Code of Conduct Tribunal has freed Seraki he has become an incorruptible judge in the circle of corrupt lawyers like Haakum, Femi Fanikayot, and other influential crooks.